Obviously disappointing. Uh, that's a good football team. I thought we had chances and we didn't close out the game. The Cardinals led for majority of the game, however, fall 23-22 in Minnesota to the Vikings for an overall 6-6 six six record. I'm Danny Sarek. This is your post-game report. Cardinals offense looked much better this week than last. More than 400 total yards, 25 first downs, averaging five yards per carry, only one touchdown to show for it. Head coach Jonathan Gannon says they have to do a better job in the red zone, punching the ball into the end zone for touchdowns rather than field goals. The Cardinals bend but don't break defense had a season best third down defense, keeping Minnesota just one of eight in those situations. However, in the fourth quarter, Vikings offense took control, accruing almost half of their total yards in that final frame. I mean, we kind of knew coming into the half that, you know, we was playing pretty good ball on defense and, you know, coming out second half, they was going to try to speed things up to try to get a rhythm. And, you know, I feel like we did a good job of that. You know, like I said, I feel like we just didn't make enough plays, you know, to sustain it. Arizona will have to flush this loss and turn the page quickly to Seattle. It'll be the second time in three weeks the Cardinals and Seahawks will face off in a tight NFC West division race. A win against a divisional opponent will hold heavy playoff implications. Stay locked in on azcardinals.com all week long for team news and updates. I'm Danny Sarek. Thanks so much for tuning in to your postgame report.